I'm going to show you how you can take any screenshot of an N8N workflow, such as this one I found on Reddit, use AI to turn it into an actual workflow. I'm a big fan of finding templates for N8N so I don't have to build them from scratch. But the problem is when I'm looking for templates online, a lot of times people don't include the workflow JSON file. They just have a screenshot. So there's a ton on Reddit and the community where the code is not included. They just show you the screenshot. What if you can just take the screenshot and then using AI reverse engineer it? So I found a prompt to do that, but we're gonna go beyond just a prompt. By the end of the video, I'll also teach you how to make this. A web app where you can just drop in a screenshot and it'll export the JSON so you can import it into your N8N. All right, so let's do a demo first. Let's go to Reddit and find a workflow that I'm interested in. And I'm looking for templates that I can use. And this one is a LinkedIn enrichment bot, but it doesn't have any code included. So it explains what it is, but doesn't really give you the workflow, but it has 28 upvotes. So let's download this file. And now that I have the file downloaded, I can just use my app. This is the screenshot of the workflow and then generate. So what's happening behind the scenes is that I have a prompt that takes the screenshot and then reverse engineers it and then it spits out the JSON file so I can import it into N8N. So let's see how it goes. Okay, and let's download the JSON. Come in here, create a new workflow. Let's import the JSON file. And there you have it. It absolutely blew my mind. So let's compare this and let's have a side by side comparison to the image. So this is the image and it's basically identical. So this is amazing because I've just taken a screenshot and turned it into a JSON workflow and cloned it completely. So how do you do this? This is gonna save you so much time from creating workflows from scratch. Whenever you see an image or a video of a workflow, you can now just take a screenshot, saving you tons of time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. You can find all the workflows and prompts inside my NAS AI community, where there's over 1,500 members. Get the link below and join my community. So how do you use this? There's three ways. You can either just use the prompt, use my PO app, or create your own little web app, bot, or artifact. So I have this really sophisticated and really long AI prompt that you can use. Once you've downloaded it, copy, and go to Claude, ChatGPT, whatever LLM you're using. Just paste the prompt in and attach the image that you have. It will generate the workflow for you, just like this. So it's really straightforward, really simple, and you can do that. You'll need to keep pressing continue a few times because it does this in several stages. So it will take a little bit of time. If you don't wanna do that, there's a faster way. I've created a PO app. If you go to po.com slash N8N from screenshot, upload your image and just enter and you can start using that. The third way is if you plan to use this a lot, then it's worth creating some sort of bot or web app for it so you can keep using it without prompting every time. If you wanna create a web app similar to mine, here I'm using Replit, and I'm going to teach you how you can vibe code this web app for yourself quickly. You can do it in Replit or something like Claude Code, come to Artifacts and create an Artifact app or website. So how do you make a web app using the prompt that I provided? There's two steps. Number one, you provide it with the prompt and description, and Claude will start coding away but that's not enough because it needs to call an AI to analyze data and then give you back JSON. To call the AI, you need to connect to an LLM through an API. The way you do that is through Open Router. So let me show you how it works. I start with saying, 
create a web app that takes in an N8 and workflow screenshot and reverse engineer to create a N8 and JSON workflow. And I pasted in the prompt that I've shared earlier. It'll start building and it will create a layout just like this, but it still won't work. What you need to do is connect it to a service like Open Router. Open Router allows you to connect to Gemini, Claw, Perplexity, and do all the heavy lifting of reverse engineering this. And you'll need to go inside and create a key. Here I have a N8N screenshot key. Just click on Create API Key. Then you need to go back to Replit or Claude Artifacts, whatever you're using, and tell it that you are using. And then the second step is you got to tell it to use Open Router. So I'm using Open Router and then copy and paste your key inside and it will be smart enough to use it and now you've completed a web app and it should work so give it the prompt add open router give it your key and then it'll call the ai and generate you the workflow so that's how you create something like this i hope you find this useful like and subscribe join my community and get all the instructions in my community